Hello and welcome to this video everyone. If you've seen the locals from a couple of weeks ago, you already know what this is about. But just to lay out the basic rules again, uh, locals is kind of a challenge run, uh, which is a legitimate speedrun category on speedrun.com. But the goal is to beat the game in as little spellcast as possible. A couple of weeks ago we've done it in 66 spellcasts, which was world record at the time. But I know 65 is possible, so today is going to be our journey to trying to get the fabled 65. And uh, let's see how we did. Did we get it? We'll find out. Um, yes, lowest cast is what matters. If there's a run with the same of amount of cast, it's lowest time. Exactly like that. It's like minimal captures in Odyssey. How's it going, Fiji? Welcome in. Yeah, DX Window, I don't think is a good program, to be honest. I would love to have, like, a, um, a alternative, but let's start. Uh, you can request it twice, Garrity. That also works. Like, if you want to add another hour, you got to request it twice, though. I know, I know it's quite expensive, but that's that's the way I solved it. Is cutscene skip a cast? Why would cutscene skip be a cast? <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> That's, that, those are completely different things. Uh, also, to answer the question, Bicorn Pixie Ride, it's like a kind of a silly strat. Um, oh, don't cast on that. Uh, so, you know the, I guess, second room in Bicorn after the stairs that go down? Oh, because I was watching the cutscene, I see. I was, I was just mentally preparing. Um... But after the stair that leads down, where you have to cast Lumos, or we are supposed to lose do, cast Lumos, the next room you're supposed to cast Scourge to uh, get the bridge up. And we don't do that. We lure a pixie down there and ride it to the top, which is very difficult. It's a very, very difficult run. And um, yeah. HP games giving 5 hours for 100k. Yeah, because I know those, so I don't have to learn something. It's just like learning a new game takes me a long time. People that requested new game, non-HP game, know it takes me a while. It just takes time. And uh, yeah, it's just I don't have that much right now, unfortunately. Yeah, it's a cool strat. This this run has a lot of cool strats. Locust is awesome, honestly. Where I never see that cutscene when you play the game. The one with Dobby. That's a good question. I assume you've skipped it. Uh, just drag it. Same as for HP2, you can just drag and drop the window. Alt tap and then just drag and drop. Demon Slayer, oh god. You have to learn shit, just play fast. Yeah, that's a hard game though, isn't it? Oh boy. Yes, I will, Alu, I will. Also, like, once I'm done with Forest, please all of you, like, yell at me so I don't forget. I was so stupid, man. We had the the 65 and then that happened. I, I'm actually still a bit mad about that, I have to say. Not really. Is it not that hard? I thought it's really hard, Demon Slayer. Maybe I'm confused then. Oh, I confuse it with Demon Souls. I'm an idiot. That's a different game. I thought it's like the Dark Souls one. Never mind then. Everyone runs so bouncy in this game. Yeah, they're, they're kids. They have, like, they still want to live. They have still, like, you know, eff uh, not effort, that's the word, no, the wrong word, but they still have hopes and dreams, so they, they walk in a very um, excited manner. No, no, once you... Oh, actually, oh, I forgot. Yeah, this game resets if you uh, if you restart it. You can change it in the I and I in that case. You can You can change your window size. Um, I think it's called Viewport X and Y, I believe, in the in the uh, game I and I. So if you change those to whatever you want in your window size, then it should save uh, every time you start it. Their super mod is fucking Pepega. Wait, why? What did their super mod, super mod do? They got some pep in their step. That's a great way to say it. How's your wizard? Welcome in. Nice timing. You join again for Locas, but we do need that because um, we need your luck to get us through the doors, honestly. It wouldn't let you in HP3? What? What do you mean it wouldn't let you? Like, it doesn't work? Maybe you're changing the wrong uh, values, to be honest. Maybe it's a bit confusing. Uh, or do you, can you not, like, update it or what? I'm, I'm confused. I mean, I'm sure you'll figure it out. I know that's how I've done it, so... Wouldn't let you edit the file. Okay, that's weird. I know that that's how I've done it for HP3. I guess that's all I can say. So I know it works. 
I'm, I'm sure you'll find a way to figure it out. You're, you're, you're smart. Ah, I see, Gary. Yeah, that's annoying. If you want to get into a game, then if there's no Discord to learn stuff, that makes it a bit harder. Oh, that's maybe not good. Uh, yeah, exactly, Wizard. Actually, I enjoyed HP5. It wasn't terrible today, for sure. Okay, good thing that this crab is literally always absolutely Pepega. I did that 100% wrong, but it still worked, because that crab is an idiot. Yeah, I see, Gary, I see. Maybe he didn't see it yet. Depends on when you message the mod, I guess. I'm sure he's gonna answer eventually, right? I don't know why I'm jumping. I'm glad Thomas isn't here to criticize me for constant jumping. Oops. You enjoy watching HP5? I enjoy watching HP5 Hundo. Good run. Hello. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe that is a Ron Ron's Animagus might be a crab. Or a snail, to be honest. Oops. Like, I think either of those two makes sense. Also, I, I don't understand why you sometimes get a medium ledge grab on that. Like, I don't get it. I, I don't know what it depends on. Like, you saw when I tried to get the long ledge grab to boost up there, the first time I just got a medium, and I, I really don't know why. It's, it's weird. All right, Gnome. Time for pain. Oh, that's good. No, that's not good. Never mind. Almost good. I mean, to be fair, getting this Gnome is not too bad, usually. What we do with him in the end, that's a different story. There we go. No, that's fine. We should we should we shouldn't be there in a minute and a half yet because we have this part to do, right? Why do you take the star in Locust? Because we need beans. So we need to um, stay in the bean bonus room as long as we can. As long as we possibly can. We wanna stay in there. How do you see me here, mate? Oh my god, feck off. Okay, this is shit. How did you see me there? He didn't do the slide. Yeah, yeah, I'll remember to not forget a card this time. What is this? And you're Polish. Thank you for the good luck. Appreciate that. Okay, you saw me. One, two, three. Good. Oh, this might actually be good as well. This might be a good angle. Huh, idiot. No! <laughs> oh, come on. What the fuck? How's that not in? That's, that's bullshit. I'm just saying. Ah, it's fine. This can still be good. Okay, we gotta reset him. This is not gonna work. What? No! Oh, come on. What happened there? That's whatever. We can lose time. That's the good thing. Like, time does not matter too much if I get a 65, right? Like, that's what you want. Okay, you saw me very late, my friend. Yeah, I mean, that certainly reset him, that's true. Can't, can't say it didn't reset him. Come on, how are you not sliding in there, my friend? That's kind of bullshit, I'm just saying. Uh, uh, well, like, allegedly, I, I mean, I believe, I believe TK, but there's like... No proof that the TK's run ever happened, unfortunately. Like, uh, she didn't save the VOD. So, l nobody officially has a 65, no. And we also don't know the time, unfortunately, of that run. That would have been a 65. So, yeah, no, officially, like, no one has it. Why do they not see me sometimes? One, two, three. I already added those, by the way. Cast get reset if you die, so, yeah. I might actually want to reset this, to be honest. But yeah, I told you we wouldn't be at the gnome throw in a minute and a half. I, I was fully confident about that. Oh. Last time I stopped him, like, in the correct spot, so I'm surprised. Yeah, they don't want to be manipulated right now, Cherub. I don't know why. They're kind of assholes right now, but welcome in. Come on, surely you go in now. How is that not in? I'm so frustrated. They're literally on the brink of like falling in. Oh so yeah, sorry for all the gnome abuse, I know. I feel bad for the for the gnome too that he has to like deal with us being idiots. And being like Harry's hand. I I am doing well, but 
I am also annoyed by this. One, two, three. Already added those, so we are at four. Like, this one's easy because you don't have to manipulate. You just have to wait until it's in, like, a good spot. This one, however, this is not gonna be good. I've tried this position. Like, I don't understand why it doesn't want to go in right now. It's really, really annoying. Maybe, like, here? Maybe this? Yeah, maybe this. I don't think we tried this one yet. Come on. This looks like it could be a good angle, actually. Just slide in. Yes! Fuck! King hell, that took way too long. Yeah, I mean, there's a reason why there's a 7 minute time save in Rick 2. That's not even the worst of Rick 2. There's like a, 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 like at least a skill based strat, but it's pretty hard later. That one I feel like is just kind of, I wouldn't say random, but it's like really hard to manipulate. I'm pretty sure it's actually not random, but yeah, it's just tough. Okay. Thanks for the people claps. Quite happy we're done with that. That's a cast, by the way, which we need. Uh, what? I agree with that, by the way. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I agree that we would that we should get the HP one um, crap model into this game. They're way cooler than the HP two firecrafts. Always these gnomes that have you do dumb strats. Yeah, I know. I, it's great. It's always it's always like carrying gnomes into different areas. It's awesome. Yeah, there are like Bicorn is the craziest level chirp. So thank you, <laughs> thank you for making it that hard, or at least for helping with that. Yeah, shout out to TK for finding most of those strats. To be honest, pretty sick. Imagine gnome right here. Like where exactly? And for what? Like which category? Oh, like on the on the lock that you have to push. Can you stop suiciding, frog? I want that health, man. I mean, we don't. We're not missing much. Room with switches. Oh, can you like skip the trigger like that? Can you gnome right above or like across the trigger or something? Okay, first try. At least that worked well, and that's one for the believers. Cool. We take those, we take those. Yeah, thanks for the door strat, exactly. Thanks for clipping through. I mean, it could have been a lot better without failing the first manip, which is not even that hard for like five minutes or whatever I did. If you could, oh my god, yeah. I mean, that would be, in oh wait, that would be insane, yeah. Such a shame you can't stand on that one. That would be mental if that would be possible. Oh, that's not the prediction. Oh, the prediction is about the freaking ride. I'm an idiot. Oh, no. <laughs> I was actually happy. I was happy that the believers won yet again, but... Dang. I, I wasn't... I Yeah, I forgot it's actually about the pixie ride. Okay. Almost dying because I almost missed that latch. I don't think you die on that, but still. All right, time for my favorite part of this run. Let's get some house points for yet even more beans. Yeah, this run has a lot of cool strats that you'd never see in like any other run. Like, hey, hitting the trigger from out of bounds that just exists here. Because why not? No, no, it's all good, Mark. That's a good prediction. Last time we also had like getting the gnome throw that I've just done within five tries. So I thought we have it again, but no, it's, it's perfectly fine with the pixie run. That is good. You still get that within... Is it five or ten tries? I don't even know how many you put. <laughs> I'll try my best. I try my hardest no matter what. Oh, Gryffindor scored, really. Yep, there's just a trigger for the Quidditch match out there. Uh, there's another trigger that puts you into the training. There's like literally two right next to each other, so you have to make sure to hit the correct one. Oh, you just did the last one. Okay, then it's 10. Nice. Um, how's it going, Perpetuum? They were fun. We did an HP5 single year, which I'm actually very happy with that time overall. And now we are doing some low cast. How was your day? Welcome in. Yeah, if you, if you go there, like, in debug mode and do show all for the triggers, they're, like, literally right next to each other. 
It didn't just say that also, probably, Gary, yeah. Like, literally, the fact that you can't stand on gnomes in Bicorn helps so much for those meme runs. Might score transfer we good here. Huh. Um, yeah. Oh, it would be, wouldn't it, for the last match? Oh, God, I almost... I'm glad I missed that trigger because I didn't I almost didn't select the correct match. Wouldn't that be really good for the last match? Because you can't really beat that right now. We don't have like the armor and stuff, so it's really rough to beat the last match, so we don't do it. I could just do another one. Oh, that would be good, wouldn't it? But the, no, but the thing is how many points do they have? 66. Yeah, I guess I'll try that. It gives us some like extra time in the beam bonus rooms later on as well. And that means I might be able to skip like another card even. Um, wait, which cards do we get? Willow, that one we always get. That one is so quick. We get the outside card. I might be able to skip that. Which other bronze cards do we get? I can't think of any right now. Wait, which other bronze cards do I get? Oh, Hagrid's Hut. That one we shouldn't skip. That one's easy. What's the fourth one? There's a fourth bronze card somewhere that's out in the open that we get. Which one is that? Also, I would love to. Uh, I would actually. I would actually enjoy playing that. I like hard maps, but they shouldn't be unfair. You know, that one seems a bit unfair. Um, too late for a Trigmania shit fest. Shame. You mean cup of the day, I assume. Oh wait, or, or the actual shit fest like cup or whatever it is. Oh, so yeah, we uh we we want two health bars exactly. That's why we have to do Quidditch and go into the bean bonus room, get house points, go to the bean bonus room longer, get beans, get a second health bar. That's the whole reason we're doing this. And yeah, we're gonna do like six pick matches it, essentially. Pick it, pick it. Willow outside. Outside, oh yeah, that is four. I mean, I'm, dude, I don't know what's wrong with me. Don't, don't mind me. Yeah, with that in mind, we could technically skip. Um, hmm. And if you skip the one outside, you just lose so much time going back to it. It's such a shame that getting the the card in forest as the tenth bronze card soft locks your game. It's like so silly. If that wouldn't happen, it would be like so nice actually. We'll just see how many beans we get. I might skip cards according on that. Maybe we can even buy eight. With the score transfer that Mark just proposed. I'm gonna try that for sure. Might be a good idea. Yeah, thanks Redburn by the way. Also welcome. Imagine not knowing that as the runner and getting like completely confused. <laughs> oh god. Oh yeah, that sounds awful, Keldeo. Oh, like imagine like a super hard jump and run room and then after you're done you need to door clip and it's like you can die any second. I really want to build a custom map, honestly. I really would love to build one. But right now I don't like the editor enough. I kind of want a, a dummy version of the editor for idiots like me. I would really love to build something that's like really challenging. It, it's not supposed to be unfair again. You gotta find that small that small sweet spot between unfair and just like hard. But I would love to do that. I would probably build that on, on stream as well, to be honest. So dang, two months, four days. That's pretty sick. What happens if you leave cards sitting there after buying? Oh, ooh. Can someone try that real quick? <laughs> Does someone mind? Because I like that idea. Does anyone that have HP2, can you try like buying cards? You can do it in debug mode as well, but like buy cards, go into a challenge and then come back and see if they're still there. I assume they disappear, but I don't actually know. It would be awesome if anyone would actually try that right now. That would be really great. Also nice Gryffindor, 20 points, let's go. I like that idea, uh, Redburn. Yeah, I don't even know why Wood still wants to practice with us after this. Like, let's be honest, this guy doesn't need any practice, clearly. Clearly Harry is prepared. No, yeah, no, but the, the point is like picking it up later. Because we need 10 cards, right? But I, the card in Forest cannot be the 10th card we pick up. 
because it softlocks the game, because this game's stupid. Like, if you get the celebration animation in Forest, your game's literally softlocked for whatever reason. So the idea would be to buy the cards, leave one there, get the one in Forest as 9th, and then come back and get the one we bought in the castle as 10th. I just don't know if that would work. That would be optimal though. So again, if anyone feels the need to uh, open up the HP2 and test that real quick, that would be quite awesome. I did not hear that, Alu, but that is, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I think they actually were pretty good friends, right? Vin Diesel and Paul Walker. Ooh, one, once leaving, once arriving. Uh, all right, have a good one, Red. Maybe we'll see you back as usual. Um, and how's it going, Hans? Good to see you around. We're doing the Quidditch matches for house points. Because more house points equals more time in the bean bonus room. Uh, b buy a card, go to like a challenge, like change your game state so it's, let's say like before Spongify or something. And you buy a card, go play Spongify, whatnot, or play Forest or any level, or goes through with ghost mode I guess also works, and then uh, see if it's still there. That would be optimal, no, only if anyone wants to do that, but I just, I just kind of want to know, it would be great to know. I mean I could also still reset to be fair and restart this and just uh, test it myself. Why more time in the bean bonus room? Because we need beans. <laughs> we need beans to buy cards, and we need beans to buy potion ingredients, and we just need beans. Or do you mean why does it give us more time in the bean bonus room? Because the, the time depends on the gap between the house points of Gryffindor and Slytherin. Oh, han tappade. How do you come? Like, how did that happen? How are you back? Are we still winning this actually? We might be losing this. No, we're winning this. Close though. Yeah, why do we even play the game? That's a good question. They almost died as well. This was like way too close. But we won, so we're gonna get the points. Well, then why are you asking, Sammy? <laughs> like, I don't understand. We need beans because we want to buy cards. <laughs> and we cannot get many beans because we're not allowed to do spells, so... You know, it all works together. Yeah, I'm also gonna do an additional match now um, because of what Mark just brought up as a um, as a potential improvement with the score transfer. Oh, yeah, oh, okay, that was the the piece of information you were missing. I feel like I've mentioned that, but maybe I haven't. I I don't make a lot of sense a lot of times. Uh, also, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Okay, let's see. Let's see if this works. How many house points do we have right now? 360, that's easy to remember, okay. Let's see if this actually does add us house points, what Mark proposed. So, essentially there's six matches, right? But the last match is really hard to beat if you don't have the broomstick and the armor. It's like almost impossible. So, um, but there is a glitch with... If you beat another match and you click on the menu or in the on the game in the menu, then you should transfer the score. So that way we can kind of cheese the game, hopefully, and make the game believe that we actually beat the Slytherin match. That's like impossible. And get some extra house points. Yep, a circle, a circle of house points. That's what I had to think think about as well. Yeah, I hope the non-believers are scared. Okay, so now we go to this menu, click on this, F4, and this should give us the, the winning score in the in the Slytherin match now. Um, we'll see if we get points for that as well. We'll see if that works. If not, I lost a minute. If it does, then we should save a lot of beans or get a lot more beans in the bean bonus room. Yeah, it does work. Okay, we got the 40 house points. We're at 400 now. Let's go. Okay, that's cool. That, that's actually kind of a cool strat. Now we should be able to have a lot of time in the bean bonus room for this challenge. Oh, I might actually not need stars in Defindo now. Oh, that's kind of cool. Like I used to collect stars in Defindo to get some extra bean bonus room time. Dude, the bean, the bean route can be optimized like quite a lot, honestly, in this. I really don't know what the quickest would be. Abuse first try scared me. Yeah, you, you'll see. I'll, I'll, I won't get pixie right that quickly. I mean, what? We'll see. Okay, let's start here. Don't ask me why I jumped into the middle platform. I have no idea. I shouldn't have.
Okay. We get the other beans on the second time we're here. Are you abusing the gnome or the fire crabs? Everything. A everything that exists in this game gets abused by Harry in this run. I don't know. Maybe at some point if I get really bored, I try to learn that, but it's just so silly. Going for 64 is just so silly. So I'm actually happy with uh, if we get 65 in this, but Bicorn, oh man, I'm not looking forward to Bicorn. It's crazy how late that happens in this category, by the way. Like 40 minutes in or something. Um, okay, I don't think this is optimal, but let's do this now. I'm not entirely sure about the bean route in this. I don't know what I'll prefer, but whatever. <laughs> I mean, I could do that. I could actually bet myself on like believing and non-believing. Maybe I should. Oh, I should have gotten... Okay, I missed one bean there. We have, like, so much time, though. It's like, whatever. I missed one bean in the air. Yeah. <laughs> I have learned that. I have learned that the hard way, actually, yeah. Whenever V8 has points, bad GBA meme runs or Quidditch World Cup GBA meme runs aren't far. That's what I've learned. Oh, God. Okay. I wasn't sure if I was high enough, actually. For a second, I thought I would die on that. Oof, that would have been a big yikes. Ah, look at our beans. Look at us go. And that's not even gonna be the end. We still have like almost 40% of the time left, I would say. So we're gonna get some extra, no worries. It might look like we picked it clean, except the chest, which we obviously won't open because spell casts. Might seem like we picked it clean, but there's some there's some more we can get. Shh, that's not good. <laughs> uh, whoops. I did not expect to fail that lash grab. I mean, it's still fine, I think. We should still have time. Wow. Yeah, yeah, we still have more than enough time to get all of those. But even after we get all of those, this is still not all. There's more to collect in the bean bonus room. Isn't this a beautiful level? Wow. Also, this hitbox is amazing. <coughs> Apologies. I don't understand what's wrong with the hitbox of this, but... Oh god, why did I take that fall damage? But they've just uh, made it so well. It's perfect. <laughs> that would be great, Rainstar. I mean, you could be the first, you know, that's a good meme to start. That was a nice Saku. That's awesome. That's always cool if you find, like, if there's, like, any song or whatever that you've been looking for and you finally find it, that's a great feeling. Also, hey, we have so much time now that I can even... Take a zip of my water. Let's go. Good old zip. Because I'm pretty sure none of those beans are obtainable. Like for some reason you cannot jump here. It's so weird. I guess it's... Yeah, I guess it makes sense. There's like the ceiling and stuff. Like it's really hard at least to get a jump out of that. Maybe you can technically get that one. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. I mean, there wasn't much in there, to be fair. <laughs> it was like a zip left. But you're yeah, still welcome in. Nope, no, not sponsored. I'm not sponsored by water, I'm telling you. Alright, there we go. Not optimal speedrun. No, but it's fine though. Like, we might have a bit of a bit too much time no right now in the bean bonus room. But we should... Um, th that also means we're gonna have more time in future B bonus rooms, right? That's why I got, like, extra points, essentially. So the next time we go to the B bonus room, we should have more time than usual as well. Which should make it more optimal. I'm actually... I'm just gonna go for the beans I can get. We'll see how many beans we have in the end. After that, we can still kinda decide, like, the route and which bronze cards we get, I guess. Oops. And how many cards we buy as well. I might need someone to do quick math for me, though, but yeah. 
What are? Yep, sorry. Sorry for pronouncing that wrong. Also, I never skip split here. I don't know why. I, I never, never hit that split. It's not possible. The spare texture is so weird. Yeah, and the hitbox as well. They made it like really poorly, honestly. Agreed in the bean bonus room. And the hitbox of the wall next to it is even worse. That is very quick math. No, I'm, I'm gonna need some people to calculate something for me at some point in the run, but it has some time until then. Why buying just bark? Is there anyone that sells mucus around? If so, then good question. But I, I just don't feel like there's anyone close, right? That's why you buy it by the one in the grand staircase, like down there, because that's where we make the potions anyway. Yo, HP2. Yeah, I, I, I get the feeling you're here because it's HP2, huh? I know, I, some people call me Sherlock Holmes. Training after the match, after the whole season, you know? Close to drop down from Willow. Oh yeah, but towards the Findor, right? So it's... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it's like if it makes much of a difference. It might be the same time actually. Actually, it probably is faster now that I think about it. And then don't make potions at the bottom of the grand staircase, but next to McGonagall, like you proposed before as well. That might actually be faster. All right, now we have to focus again on not casting. Now we're done with all the Quidditch shenanigans, so now we have to uh, get back to what this runs about. And actually beating level without casting. Half an hour, we're entering potions. Let's go, what a pace. Yeah, that would work. But I just don't think it would be faster overall. I don't know. It's hard to tell. Hey, right, potion number one achieved. Uh, no. Snake fight, that's the reason why it's not considered cast. So that's the one good thing in the snake fight, you can kind of do whatever, doesn't really matter. Bought a card, went into Riktu and it's still there. Okay, that's really cool. Did you also finish Riktu? Thanks for testing that wrench. Uh, yeah, by the way, since you're now, I think, now back, Mark, um, we had the idea that since we now have more time in the B bonus room, I should get more points. Finished it, perfect. Thanks for checking. Then it should work, I'm just gonna try it and like risk it. I hope it's the same when you go into the Forbidden Forest. But yeah, the idea is like, I um, I make the 10th card be one in the castle. Like, I buy it, but I don't pick it up. So we get the 10th card in the castle. What? See, that's why I saved. How did I lose my mucus? What the heck? So don't get why we need beans. Well, we bought two ingredients and then we... Um... Yeah, you know what, Mark? You have a point. Fuck that cauldron. <laughs> that cauldron sucks. <laughs> Uh, so essentially we, we buy ingredients, so we have a lot of potions, that's the first time we need them, and then we also need to buy wizard cards to have an additional health bar. Otherwise we cannot, uh, we skip a cast and chamber with that essentially. Oh. Yeah. Well, I did not expect that to be close. That's weird. It's like open early. No, that's not fine. I, ne I need them for Bicorn. At least I really want them for Bicorn because of all the creatures. I I'm not I'm not risking that without. It's fine. We can just lose some time. As you, Melody, welcome in. Welcome to, to some HP2 low cast. Hope you're doing well. No, I didn't, Thomas. I don't, don't, please don't ask me about it. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> welcome in, or welcome back. Nope, we're not going for 64. If I would go for 64, I would have already fucked up. Yeah, Minix, welcome in. Also, welcome to Lowcast. Hope you guys had a good Monday. Actually, it's not that bad. It's actually kind of safe like this. You just got to angle yourself like way more into the wall, I guess. It should be fine. Yeah, this is infinite potions, by the way, for people that haven't seen this yet in this game. If you get your ingredients stuck behind the wall, then you don't lose them when you make a potion. So we are just making infinite potions right now. Nah, I feel pretty safe. If I fail, you can laugh into my face, Mark. I'll gift you a sup if I fail. <laughs> but, uh, I think we're fine. 
my favorite subject on Hogwarts. Uh, for me, it would be potions, honestly. Actually, it doesn't lose time. You have a point. Because the cauldron needs to reset anyways. Yeah, actually fair. Actually fair. Did not think about that. Yeah, you you also thought it would be potions. I, I as a kid, I actually did, did some like mixing in our kitchen. I'd mix some random like juices together and shit like that. So, you know, potions would be one hundred percent my thing. Yeah, it's kind of the cauldron is getting debated by the placebo effect pretty much. Let me make like seventeen. That should be fine. One more. <laughs> I know. I know you guys can count. Sorry. Yeah, exactly. Like, if you look at the animation, it actually flies into the cauldron, usually. And, um... And it doesn't if you get it stuck behind a wall, which is, like, so stupid. But apparently the physical wall stops the ingredients from flying in there. Chemistry students, so you, need, you have to laugh potions. Yeah, absolutely. I assume you do, right? It's gotta be your subject as well. I mean, I guess I'm biology, so I... I should like, like, you know, a chaos magical creatures, which I lo would like as well. I would enjoy that quite a bit as well. I, I drank them myself, Yotter. They were quite okay, actually. Well, not all of them, <laughs> but yeah. Nah, we don't need a damage walk, but it's like... You, you manipulate so many creatures, first of all. So you need potions for that. And then, uh, there, there's just... You'll see, we'll need a lot of potions. We need a lot of, like, times we drop, da drop down from really high up. So, rather play it safe than sorry. Like, most of it is fall damage, I believe. And then some extra in case something goes wrong. Like, you can probably optimize the potions quite a bit. But I kind of just want to chill and just be done with it. Hogwarts class tier list. Ooh, I like the idea. I would, I would probably do it. Is there no caster's way to get ingredients without buying? Nope, they are literally never in the open, unfortunately. There's no spot in this game where you don't at least have to open a chest to get a potion ingredient. So the only caster's way to get them is, unfortunately, buying them, which loses some beans. Uh, yeah, actually in chamber, yeah, but in chamber it's too late. <laughs> uh, we don't need them in chamber anymore. That's a fair point. Yeah, yeah. You, guys, you guys are correct, of course. At the very end of the game, they have them in the open. I'm pretty sure that's the only time. Though. Arithmancy and ancient runes. Yeah, because Harry and Ron are lazy. Extra work? <laughs> what? I, I swear I wanted to press that, but I guess I didn't press it hard enough. Nice. I was just stroking my button, apparently. Okay, that's that was not a fake input. Ah, uh, yeah, quite often, my guy. Yeah, I have to say, uh, but not in that case. <laughs> in bicorn, yeah, but not in the open, like either. They're all in chests and like glasses and stuff. We need um, cast for. All right. It's fine. Like this time loss is fine. It just it just hopefully enables us a bit of a chill late game. Uh, nope, I refunded. If I don't if I don't remember to do it on stream, I refund it. Like if people request it during a busy game where you don't have time. How am I not getting this? What? Excuse me. I mean, divination could be interesting, I guess, if you're not like Hermione and don't believe in it. Like if I go to a school for wizards, I would also fully believe in divination. <laughs> No, that spell cast did count. The oh, you mean the spell learning? No, no, that doesn't count. That's not using the spell. Yeah, it's only only in this game when you actually like yeet a spell when you cast it and it flies off, and yeah, that's when it counts. <laughs> wow, people bullying my scourge skip. Oh, when I just do this? No, that's not a spell cast. It's just Harry raising his wand. Hey, welcome back, wizard. We are yet on our way to make it to Bicorn. So you haven't missed much, which is good, I guess. Okay, let's see how many more beans we get than usual, I guess. <laughs> Exclamation mark cast three. Yep, exactly. Nice memes. Uh, also, I see that I see that advance. I'll, I don't know when I'll have a time for that, to be honest. It's like during HP2, it's quite hard, but I'll try to show the hashtag team bonsai. 
back to magic reality. It's one of my favorite voice lines, actually. It's, it's a pretty good one. How many cars are you buying? Uh, we, we, we figured out some alternative strats, like Mark had an idea to do the score transfer, so we, now we should have more time in the beam bonus room, because now I've beaten six matches, at least the game believes I've beaten all six matches, which should give us quite a bit more time and like quite a few more beans, so I honestly don't know, we'll see how many we can get, honestly. I need people to do math for me later, and then we'll see how many we can actually buy with um, the beans we have. Uh, how's it Raku? Well, long time no see either. How have you been? No, we didn't do score transfer. I don't know why I didn't think about that or like anyone before me in all fairness. But no, we haven't. You'd have time from all the access time you might have in the beam bonus room. Fair, but I think since we only skipped Scourge, we're not really gonna have access time, but I do see your point. Oh, also the best very well, the best verified attempt is still that because apparently no one is in charge of that leaderboard. Like I'm gonna reset that up, um, so actually runs get like verified. But uh, I I got a 66 cast essentially. That's my PB. Are you living in Germany now? That is very pock. How is that going? I hope you enjoy it, or you know, hope hope, hope it's not too bad. I mean, I don't know, V8. Like, I asked in, like, Wisecammo, like, you know, the mod channel kind of thing. Uh, I was like, yeah, I assume nobody checks that form, so I've submitted a run, you know, whoever is in charge of that, but nobody ever responded, so... I assume whoever is in charge of it doesn't even know it themselves anymore. They probably forgot about it. We don't actually have that much time, which it surprises me. Like, I can barely get those beans. That's not more than before, is it? Is it? I mean, I guess Slytherin had like a lot of... No, actually it is. Last time Slytherin just had worse house points. This is pretty okay. Hey, yo, Phil. Welcome in. Back to lo uh, back to low cast after I facted up royally yesterday. Yeah, I mean, I could have gotten some more. You can do another boost to get into the final area, but it was pretty good. Like, I won't complain. Pretty nice timing, for sure. Eat. All right. Oh, that's actually... I was about to say, fuck, I just cast it, but that, that one you have to do. <laughs> There's literally nothing else to do. Um, time for Pixie Ride, by the way. Predictions coming up. You need to know what I fucked up. I, I didn't get the 10th wizard card, so I didn't have the health bar, which, mean, which meant I couldn't do chamber. Someone tried to edit it because Zasta has moved to third place. Wait, what? <laughs> Okay, and then who's second? <laughs> Number one. Yep, time to spend an hour in Bicorn. Let's go. You guys are not ready for this Bicorn, except the people that have seen this yesterday or before. Oh, that wasn't bad. That was not bad. That was one. You are ready? Oh, you're not ready. I'm telling you. Actually, maybe you are, to be fair. Maybe maybe I underestimate my chat's readiness. Yo, Bantha. Yep, time for watching or looking at doors for literally 40 minutes. But first we have to do this shit, so yeah. First we have to do doxy shenanigans. Second is the charm. Last time I actually did a 10th try when we had the prediction last time, so we'll see. Oh yeah, you did get this up. Nice. Let's go. Welcome back to... I don't have a, I don't have a name for the subs. Oh come on, that was just bad. Second. Oh, this is the third. This cat again. Hell yeah, best category, Milan. Hey yo, Kento. It is it is a cool game. What about uh, welcome in? First of all, hope you're doing well. Not sure about the cool stream part, but I hope so. Appreciate that. Wait, is that a is that a global Twitch emote, Batman? <laughs> This is the third. Like it's, we've had we've had two tries. This is the third. So let's see. Third is the charm. That's what they say, right? Um, what are you doing? Okay. Okay. It doesn't bite us yet for some reason. Okay. <laughs> we're fine. We're fine. No. Okay. That was awful. That was like incredibly awful. <laughs> Uh, 
For the believers counting, this is the first first try. Yeah, that's the thing that's putting me off as well. But yeah, the first one was literally the best, pretty much. It's just, I just don't feel like I can influence it that much. The first try almost worked. That would have been great. I don't want to spend time here. I'm going to have to spend time on the doors anyways. I don't need to spend additional time here. That's just unnecessary. Okay, this is it though. Dude, how high do I have to go? Okay, thank you. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, that was definitely within the 10. Doesn't matter with which, with who's counting. Really? You didn't go in? It was either 9th or 10th again, depending on who you ask, I guess. Oh no, it was 8th or 9th, depending on who you ask. Um, oh yeah, for sure, Melon, yeah. Like, I'm, first I'm gonna play it casually on Halloween, though, but it sounds fun. Also, how did I ma- yeah, How did I manage to off-sync the- Snails, your counting is 17. Yeah, it's definitely not over 10, that much I can tell. Thanks for the DD. Appreciate that. Cool, we got it. Uh, we, we can still die here, but we should be fine. Actually, I can- oh god, I can still die at the gnome. Ow. Wait, what? Oh, oops. Wait, no, this is correct now. No, 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 no. Okay. Now we have to manipulate those idiots. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what you're doing right now, but keep on sliding. What the fuck are they doing? Prediction on doors. Mm, I don't know if we can put one for doors, to be honest. I don't like that both of them are here, by the way. Yeah, sounds like a good idea, man. I'm down. Like, I, it looked... The, the couple of minutes I've seen before, like, on Karak stream, looked pretty fun. Okay, I don't like that the other guy is here as well. Is he gonna go back if I just leave him alone? What is- where's he gonna go to? Oh, he is. Okay, that's good. That's actually a bit faster then. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Yeah, they are. The details you realize when you play meme runs, right, Bjotter? When you go up close and personal with the crabs. Also, this is one of the reasons we want a lot of potions. Because they do damage. Ow. Nah, I'm not gonna play Skyrim on 11.11. Hello. Just use Victor Sembra. I wish. Like, this part isn't hard. It's just really annoying. It's just really tedious. But we'll get there. It's not the most tedious part of Scourge. Oh, of Bicorn. You'll see. How's the other guy still casting at us, by the way? Also, nice miss. Let's go. Oh, I have like 18 potions. Health is not an issue. How is he missing? <laughs> You're an idiot, crap. You absolutely suck. Uh, also, no V8. I know. It comes as a surprise, probably, but nope. No, I know, I know, I know, Melon, but that run looked fun as well. I know he did a different category, but yeah. Or he is doing, I guess. Oh, okay, sorry, crap, you just got absolutely killed by the gate. Apologies. Sorry. <laughs> See you around. It's crazy how long they don't give you a safe book here, by the way. It's kind of, kind of scary, I have to admit. Hello. Hello. What? Fuck. You don't really need a safe book here? I do. <laughs> Locas would like one at least, because the gnome can kill us. Which I'm a bit worried about, but I'm still gonna take the risk. Crap has been pierced, pierced by the gate. Yeah, I feel a bit bad to be honest. That was not what I meant to do. I feel a little bit bad for that crap. Yeah, the snail did not fall for the trap. <laughs> Snail's actually five hat. Uh, can you not go in here? Why are you even able to go in there? Shouldn't be. Don't kill me. Thank you. Good. Now we get the safe book. Because ideally you want to save with the gnome in your hand, right? So... There we go. Nope. So we use this gnome now to... Oh, to kill him? Yep. To kill him, very, very gruesome. But to uh, put him in this weird-ass collision that exists here, and then he's, like, very high. That's a bit too high, I believe. Yeah, I don't think I can make it up there. Ah, shit. And then you can kind of use the latch of the, of the bridge to jump a bit higher than you could normally. That was close. And make it on the gnome. 
It's actually quite hard, but I, I'm confident we can get this. Also, the issue is the gnome downstairs can kill you as well. Nah, nah, nah. Definitely not, Mark. Not with, like, the 123 is with one door clip because I didn't bother. With two, I don't think it's gonna happen. Uh, I don't know what kind of prediction we want, actually, or if we need any, really. But thanks for, thanks for thinking about him. Yeah, killing him. You gotta kill him first and then reload. How did you not get stuck on that? Two cycle, I guess. Why not cast Wingardium Leviosa? Oh, that would be a cast, though, wizard, casting it at his shoes. Yeah, we are in the worst part now, Chirp. It's great. Come on, I can't get the slide up for some reason. I mean, two cycle works. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is hard, by the way, so I might, it might take me a few tries. The, the good news is, though, it's, like, at least not RNG. Like, it actually depends on you playing well. Come on, mate. <laughs> oh, every second throw I kill him. <laughs> no, the um, this game does not have Leviosa. This is too high, isn't it? This should be good. Can't you jump off the step to the left? You would think so, right? But nope. Same issue. It's just like for some reason the hitbox is really high. Don't ask me why. I wish. That would make this a lot easier. <laughs> yeah, this is like a Dormammu situation here. I don't know if the gnome has come to bargain though, to be fair. Oh man, it's, it's hard. I don't know, we've gotten this really well last run, but right now I'm just not doing this well, I guess. What? I jumped. I actually like the spot he was in, so kind of sucks. Come on, why are you not getting height? You're nervous from that? I mean, this part is fine because there's a safe book right in front of it. Once we get it, that's when the fun begins. That's when the nervousness begins. What? I, sometimes he doesn't jump. I don't understand. Yeah, this, this might take a while, but this is literally not the worst part of Bicorn. You'll, you'll see. If you haven't seen it before. This angle doesn't work right now. I think you need like something like this. Oh, there we go. Finally. I think my angle was just wrong the entire time. All right. Heat green skirt. Yeah, who doesn't? Same here. Okay, please don't kill me, no. Please, please, please don't kill me. Ah, not good enough. Plus, the 600 beans is quite good, I think, already. Yep, that's good. Didn't kill me. Don't have to do the bridge skip again. Actually, I can still fail the wall walk, to be honest. Even though that's a normal speedrun strat, I am not good. So, uh, that can still happen. This one. It shouldn't, though. Good. Alright. Cool. That's another one that you unfortunately cannot skip, at least not as of right now. Yeah, we're making swift progress to our old friend the door, exactly. Safe book, yes. Ow. Um, we want to buy cards with it. Oh god, that was close. For the, the first room and chamber, Ape. Because you... you barely lose a bit more than one health bar if you jump down. We didn't find any other way to make it down um, without using a cast. So that way we can, like we don't use cast to collect beans. And that way we save like one spell cast in jumping down. All right, here we are. Let the fun begin. Let the RNG clipping begin. Oh, oh God, I don't want to, but it's okay. We'll, we'll get there, we'll get there. We just need some patience. Reach the door. You'll die twice and then get it perfect. Okay, I like that. I like that as a as a forecast. That would be quite quick if that works. He's not turning the correct direction at all right now. 
Yeah, Harry doesn't understand padlocks. Instead of like, he doesn't know he's supposed to cast Alomora. He thinks he has to clip through, just what normal people would do. That was close though. He almost walked us in. <laughs> I like the Hermione emote there, Piotrick. That is very fitting. Also welcome in. Yeah, I honestly don't know, like, I assume TK found this as well. I don't know where that patience came from. Like, it doesn't even look like it's possible. Come on. I don't... That's another one. See, like, is that actually proven to be possible, though, Melon? Because that's another one where I think people are just like, yeah, you can get a small ledge grab and then boost on the platform in the middle. But I just don't think you can. Like, I think that's one of another one where it's like people just pretend it's possible. Teda got it? Uh, I would I need to see a video before before I believe that. There's a VOD. Oh, okay. Yeah, in that case, that's fair. I still don't want to go for that. I'd rather grind for cards because that seems awful. How's it, Quinn? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Welcome to me. Probably trying to clip through this door for 40 minutes. We'll see. We'll see how long it's going to take. I think I soft locked the gnome. Nice. I should have just suicided and not reloaded. Whatever. Yeah, it's a good time to join in for sure. It's a perfect time to join in, you know. This is more fun than anything else will ever be. Oops. If that couldn't work. Mm. Here we go again. Oops, that's not good. Nah, it's the angle has to be straight, otherwise you're not gonna make it. Ah, oh, this is not bad. It's just he's just walking to the right too much. Like you, you can see how we're clipping. It's just not like through the door. It's more into the wall, so we die. That's how's it going, Inca? Teda says he used macros. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> there you go. What, what do you mean diagonally? Forward left, yeah. But uh, if the gnome walks to the right, he still kills me. Oh, that was close though. Why is this gnome so noisy? He is, right? Yeah, like he he's walking faster essentially. Like he if he if he wants to go to the wall, he goes to the wall. Yeah, thanks for looking that up, by the way, Thomas. But see, I, I thought so. I, I do, because it doesn't seem doable to me. I've tried that boost. It just doesn't seem humanly possible with macros. Sure, I guess. Fair enough. Hey, boo. Come on, at least let me get it like once. If I die after, sure, I can do this again. But let me give it, get like the initial satisfaction of getting it. Oh, that looks so good. How is that not making it neat? Nope, not quite. I hope the thickness of the gnome does not influence it. I doubt it. I, I honestly don't know if that's been ever like fully clear if the hitbox of the gnome is different the, like actually depending on its thickness but i don't think it is ah oh, this part's fun last time it did take us like 40 or 50 minutes or something so get comfy we're gonna be here for a while and that's okay that's the that's the point of low cast i guess you do dumb shit we should investigate the gnome agreed okay not bad now we the issue is this is no time to celebrate yet. Oh, nice ledge grab, whatever. It's fine. Like we sh we shouldn't clap yet. Also, I kind of want that. Come back. Oh, he bonked his head. Okay, in that case, I don't want him anymore. He's stupid. I don't eat stupid frogs. Exclamation mark, locust. Pity. It's in, like in the title. What? You didn't die on that? Come on. Or fall over, sorry. No, I knew it would happen. I, sometimes you can't jump off. It sucks so bad. Fuck you, Gnome. You're an asshole. See? That's why you don't, you don't celebrate yet. Because that happens. 11 minutes later. Yeah, Gnome being the Gnome. Come on, it looks it's so close. All the time. It looks like we make it, but then we don't make it. I don't understand. Like, you literally need the perfect angle for him to turn. It's so RNG-based. Okay, that's the perfect angle for him to turn. We have a second chance. 
Thank you. No, this guy kills us again. I, I, I can see it coming. Okay. Oh, he didn't go in though. Fuck. Ah, okay, Lemon. Okay, that that I can that I, that I'm okay with. Perfect. This is better. So that doesn't kill us. But we still need to get through the second door. Now nah, it's not really in the middle of the door. It's like, it's it's. I mean, it's essentially where I'm standing. It's like the the middle right ish. Like it's not super far to the right, but it's like a little bit to the right. I almost didn't jump. Jesus Christ, that was so silly. All right. Please don't kill me. But yeah, yeah, pr pretty much that though, HP2. Like, it's it's middle-ish. If he would have suicided right now, I would have been very upset. For this one, I have like a, s a little bit of a different strat. Yeah, this one. Like that, but not into the wall. 20 minutes later. Uh, this door, I believe, we've been on it like, oh yeah, for at least half an hour now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, I, yeah, I don't know. It's probably interesting, Aichan, but also a thing I, I didn't really want to think about. And I'm actually curious about the reason, but I'm not going to ask. Okay, there we go. It was a fun small talk chat. We, we made it. Thank you. Was fun was fun talking to you or listening to your stories. I was screw you, frog. Yeah, you can give me one G, half a GG, because we still need like this. Okay, I wanna I wanna try to get this like as safe as possible. But it's like he doesn't go into the thing if I play that safe. Like I I need to be on his head for a while so he goes in there, otherwise he won't. It's like a bit annoying. I just don't want him to kill me. That should be... Dude, he's not going in there, mate. Go in your freaking gnome hole. You stupid idiot. Imagine actually accidentally casting at him in rage. That would have sucked. Okay, there we go. See, it, it like that looked really risky. He almost pushed us into the wall, but you gotta do that. Yeah, actually, it actually does. Every time I ask for like stories, I it, I feel I feel like I'm getting it. Really? You, oh, of course, you freaking now root to run out of it and not towards me. Oh god, oh god. Okay, we're fine. Please. Thank you. That should be fine, right? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. We didn't get killed by this guy. That's good. Oh no. Don't tell me we're gonna get the pixie glitch again, please. That's all I want. No, 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 no. Piss off. Or bite me. No! This is so weird. How does this happen? What is this? Why? Who made this room? So now we're fucked or what? Like, this is so dumb. Like, what do I do about that? It's just... <laughs> Can I go back, maybe? Does that help? Like, I just don't understand. <laughs> Dude, they literally... They're literally stupid. I don't know what to do. I can't lose the gnome either. Oh, okay. Okay, 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 we're fine, I guess. Oh god. Like, if the pixies follow you, you cannot get this cliff, because they're always gonna, like, bonk you around, essentially. Thanks for the follow, appreciate it. And sometimes they just don't want to attack you, but they also don't leave. It's it's weird. We're gonna die here, by the way. I was about to say, if you run off... <laughs> Okay, we need him to be like in a stable position here where he doesn't run off, where he's just like, we're on top of him. Nope, that's not good. That's also not good. Yeah, and Naruto Emo will be kind of cool of the gnome Naruto running. It's such a weird animation if you think about it. Okay, yeah, that's the one I want. Perfect. So now we just spin left. I know, that's, that's the wrong direction, though. And then like this, with a bit of luck, he spins us directly into the, well, missing collision or poorly placed collision or whatever it is. But he's spinning to the right for some reason. Yeah, the the other left, Mr. Gnome, please. This is okay, though. I think this is like a decent spot. He just has to finally, like, do big swings or big spins. Maybe? No, don't push me into the wall, my friend. Just don't. Ask for stories. Yeah, does anyone have any interesting stories to tell? <laughs> I 
Okay, it's fine. At least we're at a, at a different door for once. We just have to make sure he doesn't push us into the wall. That's the main thing. <laughs> I did, but I do you didn't like it. Yeah, fair point. Anyone except Aichan with like any interesting stories? Yesterday you ate an apple. That is one hell of a story indeed. Okay, this maybe... I don't know if we actually change our position right now. I don't think so. I hated Naruto's ending. I honestly don't know what happens at Naruto's ending, but maybe we shouldn't spoil people here, eh? Reheated lasagna. I did not eat reheated lasagna, indeed. I, I'm surprised you remember that story. What kind of stories do I like? Uh, that's a good question, actually. Stories that push me through the door would be great. Oh, this doesn't look good anymore. He's like too far away from the door. I don't know why. Okay, Noam, can you please, like, get closer to the door? <laughs> Did it have mayo? <laughs> mayo on lasagna, what the heck? That is next level awful. My life as a zucchini, okay. I, what, what's, what's the movie about? Honestly, I think I should have to reset this up. Mayo on lasagna, that sounds incredibly awful. I can see banana on an omelette more than mayo on a lasagna, I have to say. Yeah, this doesn't look too... Actually, this looks promising, but he's not quite getting us through. Because I think he's too far away from the door, but I don't know how to fix that with, like, movement. Come on, get closer to the door, my friend. No, he's good. Okay, now we screwed it. Okay, that's fine, though. That's fine, though. As long as he doesn't kill us, it's all good. I don't care about losing time. Okay, this looks better. He's I think he's closer to the door now. Oh, I hate this part. This part is like so much anxiety because you really... No. Because you really don't want to die. Oh my god, I don't know if he's pushing me through or like killing me, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know what his plan is. That's good though. This is good. No! You... No! Oh, come on! <laughs> I'm never gonna get this again. Yesterday was the one time. This is not gonna... It's not gonna happen. It's just too stupid. It's just actually too stupid. <laughs> yeah, sounds like the average day in the life of a Dutch person, yes, sir. Yep. Pretty much. You forgot the tulips, though. When when do those come into play? Why is 5 GBA so quick? Uh, because you do what games always tell you to not do, which is uh, resetting the console during a save. So that's what we do. The game says we reset the console, there's a thing called save corrupt happening, and you skip to the end. Ah, I gotcha, Quark. I, th I thought so. While sleeping with Prosty. That's important. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the important part. Uh, yes, I do. They have translated it into German, French. Um, because apparently the Dutch version was a very big success here as well. I honestly didn't know the Dutch version, though, I have to admit. I, I only knew it be when it became like popular, when they made the German version. So uh, if you if you look that up in German, you'll okay. We have the same issue again. Are you gonna bite me? Okay, I don't understand what's like. I mean, I guess I can trap them here, right? Yeah, I guess we can. Oh no. Oh yeah, maybe. I guess this works. Interesting way to get rid of it. Oh no, they come hey, back. Hey Nixo, this is Pokemon. Do you want to play Valorant with me? <laughs> Hello, Pokemon. Uh, apparently that's the name. German takes to speech is never wrong. Uh, thank you so much for the 60 month. How's it going? Oh my god, now we have the, another one. It's so annoying, man. Those pixies are coded like so poorly. I, like, what do I do about it? Actually, I don't. I'm just losing all my potions. Like, what do I do about this? <laughs> leave me alone! Actually, just leave me alone. Thank you. 
How have you been, Solomon? Thank you so much for the resale. And I, I don't know what to do about this. <laughs> what if I go further? What if I go, like, down here? Surely they won't follow me here, right? Did I just screw up? No, we're fine. Dude, what the fuck is your problem? <laughs> Leave me alone. Please. Please, just go. Oh, my God. <laughs> like, what do we do? Uh, I can't. That's the thing. They don't bite me. That's the issue. I mean, this one just did, but they, this one won't. Like, otherwise I wouldn't have an issue with that at all, but they just don't. Like, I don't know what to do about this. What if I lead it to, like... Oh, no. Okay, if you go down here, they'd stop. Interesting. But now I'm fucked. Because I have the gnome down here, so... We just... Uh, actually, we might have a chance, but... Oh, I don't know, actually, maybe. Um, okay, nope, that's not good enough. Yeah, I think we fucked. Because the pixies are broken in that room, which does not make it easier. Can you piss off? How many potions do we have left, actually? Can you make this? I don't think so. And the issue is, like, I can't pick this up without taking damage. It doesn't work. Yeah, I think we're lost. We've lost it. At least I can't think of any way. Or maybe this? I can't jump off this thing, though, right? No, you can only bounce. Yeah, that won't work. Um, this corner, maybe. Yeah, this sucks. You almost made me cast, you bastard. Because I wanted to throw him. Oh, maybe this? No, right. Yeah, like, you, you take damage, like, everywhere here. I don't think there's any spot where you don't take damage. This is so bullshit, man. I think I'm done. Like, this is absolute. Like, those pixies are so fucking trash. Like, why are they so poorly coded? One hour later. Yeah, so 68, you can skip three dumb ones. Like, those two, and then, I guess, a third of your choice. Whichever you don't want to do. I thought that's probably a good idea. Can you toss the gnome? To do what? Any old charms? Welcome in. Yes! Okay, we have a chance. Finally. Jesus Christ. Got the correct movement. I mean, the thing is, it doesn't really do much because we'd still have to do the same thing again. So it's just... Imagine being able to skip all the spellcasts. That would be insanely cool, actually. If, if one day we can skip all of them. Good. Um, okay, check for pixies. They are gone. Let me find them. Thanks for the prages. Secret. Oh, I could just do this. Uh, okay. I, I, I'm always scared he runs off. I don't know why. Yeah, if you cross the bridge without using the Lumos, it's like it opens. It's a really silly secret. Essentially, it rewards it rewards you for being good at jump and run. Yeah, please. Oh, that's that explains the door. Oh god, that explains why it was so bad or why it didn't work well, because you weren't there to uh, help us out. You never knew of that one. Really interesting. It's a cool. I mean, it's a cool secret, but it's like it's also kind of weird. Stop. No, that's not gonna work. He was way too aggressive. Like we need him to be in a in a chill. Yeah, this like this kind of position. And then he needs to spin to the left and not the right, like this. And then he might push us in, but just maybe. I would have died. I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, that's kind of what I like. I, I I walk back a bit and like like right, and that usually makes him spin to the left. But it's still like it's so silly. Yeah, but essentially that way I try to manipulate him. I hate everything. One and a half hours for this shit. One and a half. Don't cast. Don't cast on this. And at least we've made the fin raid actually made. I think I would have been like done soon. So, thanks for the raid. I guess that that did that did give the extra power. 
Okay, so this time, let's not forget a card. Let's not cast a random spell yeah, that we don't need. Yo, thanks for gifting the sub as well. You already saved the run, you don't have to give the sub. Thank you so much though, I appreciate that. Oh my god, thankfully we're done with this. We can actually play, like the rest of the run is actually quite fun. Like the rest of the low cast strats are actually quite cool to watch in my opinion. It's just the freaking two doors are just awful. I yeah, appreciate the people as well that recommended me as a raid target. Thank you, thank you. Okay, now we can now we can properly play. Oh god, I'm so happy we at least got that. This run is gonna be an incredibly awful time, but at least we are like we're able to beat it. Nice nimble wimble now for Let's go. <laughs> Thanks for making this even slower. Can you stop mimble wimbling, please? <laughs> I mean, it does do damage, but it's like not a lot. And I think it also like confuses him. Oh, okay, that was quicker than I thought. Yeah, for people that are not aware of that trick, if you cast uh, Expelliarmus once, go to the menu, go out of the menu, you are invincible and you cannot get hit during that duel. That's what we did. So it was one spell cast. Um, but after that, Malfoy just killed himself, essentially. Yeah, finally, Rainstar, welcome back. We have finally gotten out of freaking uh, Bicorn hell. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I did not expect that to happen at all anymore. Like, this time's gonna absolutely suck now, but at least it's gonna be a 65 cast if I don't mess it up again. We'll see. Thanks, Moth, and welcome back. You totally had faith. I didn't. I absolutely didn't. I did not think it would ever happen, or like at least not today anymore. But yeah, thanks for giving, helping me with the faith, I guess. You can go take a shower. Wait, that's what you've been waiting on? You should have taken the shower during the gnome stuff, right? <laughs> nah, fair enough. Enjoy your shower. See you around. You said within the next five lives and I did it in that life. Yeah, I mean, that's fair. That must have been it. You did have faith indeed. That's actually true. Can't, can't argue with that. God, oh, this took way too long though. Like legitimately, look at that bicorn. <laughs> One hour, 37 minutes in bicorn. Probably an hour 15 in the, on the freaking doors. Like, Jesus, Jesus Christ, that's just awful. Yeah, I mean, you, you were the issue all along, Knight, obviously. <laughs> I couldn't do it when you were watching. I was too nervous, okay? I'm sorry. That, that was the actual reason. But uh, welcome back. We have made it indeed. Cool. Don't cast any spells. Don't ruin it now by being an idiot. Thank you. That's very appreciated. I shouldn't even spam left click. It's just silly in case something happens. Uh, yeah, whatever. I don't need it. We have some potions. And this boost is kind of dangerous. Um, yep, down here. I don't know why I jumped down here. I totally wanted to take even more damage. That was my plan. Get some stars that you can access easily. Which is gonna be two. <laughs> A whole two stars. Let's go. Uh, wait, where are we? Ah. I should add five. Add. I actually have slots, I think, on FFZ, so I, I would have I would have space. If someone reminds me, I can maybe I can maybe remember that. If someone reminds me, I can remember that. Makes sense, right? Okay, gonna get this star as well. They're still worth it. Even though they're like a little bit far away, they are still definitely worth it. Can you make this? I think I asked the same thing before. Oh, you can. Okay, that's actually easy. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy how many stars exist in Defender. Like freaking 14. What the heck, man? Passing this lesson is impossible. <laughs> There's way too many. I mean, it literally is impossible for us with uh, low cast. Are people not nice to Cloud? See, that's another character I know. What? 
Oh, I oh god, I went into the wrong one. It's another character I know uh, from Final Fantasy because they are in Smash Brothers. So those references, you know, I actually understand. I was actually confused for a second why the thing was locked, by the way. Like genuinely, I didn't understand. Hello. Hey, welcome back, Cougar. Or welcome in. Is it the first time? I feel like I've been here before, but good to see you around. Nope, what are you doing? Nope, calm down. Calm down, snail, please. Yeah, you want the star. Wait, actually, no, you want to do the skip. I'm an idiot. That's a fair point. I should have done the skip. Well, now we're doing it skipless. Can you... Can you even do this? Surely, right? Hello? What? No, come on. Come on! <sighs> like, which we had. Like, literally none of the characters that ex that exist in Smash are little known, are they? <laughs> or none of the games are less known. Like, pretty much all big franchises. Maybe, like, Mr. Game & Watch or stuff like that. No idea where that shit's from, but... Yeah, you can boost over. This is like the 120 FPS skip, but the gate is locked now. I should have gone for that, because this is pain. Hey, at least for the second set of snails, I learned which snail to not go for. Like, how how do you manipulate this one? This one doesn't... Like, he never sees me. This one is an idiot. He's just a stupid snail. Like, how do I get him in there? Like, he just stops chasing at some... Oh, no, he doesn't. Oh, there he does. Okay, please just see me. You see me? Why do you instantly charge? Okay, let's... Let's wait, I guess. They usually, when, when you get close to them, they kind of take a while and then they charge. So if you run around them, they like kind of turn in one spot, so... Mm. Imagine clipping through here somehow. That would be kind of cool. Dude, how far back do you want to go? <laughs> On a scale of 1 to very annoyingly far, how far do you want to go? Okay, what if I lure it like here? Does that work? What? That's where you turn? What the fuck? Oh my god, I hate this guy. What are you doing now? <laughs> do I just want to reload by Defendo and do snail skip? Honestly, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, okay. So now, now nothing happened yet. Let's not fail it, please. <laughs> it's not like super easy. Okay. Cool. Yeah, it's like you, you just boost over the trigger essentially is the idea. Okay, I've learned here as well. Like this segment, you want to use this snail because one of those, those two, just doesn't work well with this and just doesn't go in. I don't know if it's this one or the other one, but one of them just never really makes their way in. Like, I don't understand how to manipulate snails, man. This looks okay. Yeah, this looks good. Come on. Okay, that one's in. And then for the other one, we use this one. Yeah, they are individuals. This guy's stubborn. I didn't like that guy last time, so... Let's use the other one. Actually, I shouldn't be here. Okay, whatever. I triggered it anyways. No, 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 no. Come here. Please. No. Oh my god, I hate it. Okay, let's let's try it with this one until the other one gets, like, close, I guess. But I believe this one just doesn't... Actually... Maybe? Oh, this does look good. Nope. See? And that's what happens with this one. And I don't understand why. It's, like, really annoying. He just always gets stuck here. I don't get why. Here or, like, here. Okay, never mind. This worked. Okay. The lesson we learned last run literally was wrong. <laughs> good. I guess I just didn't do it correct last time. Cool. At least we're out of Defender. That took way too long, though. That was awful. Let's have a better boom slang. That's a lot of an easier level. Than, oh, the, the annoying part is done, at least. Now we can have some fun with some cool tricks. Thanks for the GG's. The partial GG. This run's, like, so much worse than the other one, and I hate it. <laughs> but at least we should be able to get the 65, hopefully. Yeah, oh, no, yeah, it's nothing compared to Vicor, and that's for sure. Like, the Findo is nothing you can't handle. It's a bit annoying, but it's like... I didn't cast, right? No, I didn't cast. I, I did let go, but I think I was already in the cutscene, right? Wait, 
I didn't cast, right? Just, just... I don't think he ever let go of the spell or, like, said anything, so I'm pretty sure this is fine. Didn't. Okay, cool. I already edited the spell cast. There we go, that's next. 18 should be correct. Yeah, true, you can, you can rewind, actually. That's a fair point. Yeah, it's rewind time. Nothing flew through the air. Yeah, and he also didn't, like, say anything, right? So I'm pretty sure this is fine. I don't think that's expel cast, personally. This is easy, except the two spell casts we sadly have to do. I did not get beans. That's okay. Wait, why do we have enter boom slang? That's the most useless split ever. <laughs> why do we have that? Oh, well. Okay, let's see uh, how many, how much time we have. We have, we have quite a good lead. I think we might be good on beans after this again. Okay, I want to start with this though for the final playthrough, because I think this like up here gives you like so many beans. Oh come on! Okay, that's actually correct. Oh god. No, no, no! I mean, nothing happened. He didn't say the incantation, and he also didn't let the spell fly away. So I'm pretty sure this is like totally fine. Not triggering the chest in the beam bonus room. <laughs> yeah, I know. Shame on me. I know it, it looks wrong when they don't when they don't get triggered, but yeah. Shame on me. I don't think I'll bother getting those because I have to walk back so much. Okay, let's see how how our bean count is gonna look at the end of this. Either the chests are triggered or I'm triggered. Hey, I can live with a fully triggered chat if I get the 65. That, that's fine for me. <laughs> it's a fair trade-off. Yeah, I mean, I could always just reload if I realized that I cast it. Like, if I would accidentally cast it something, I could always just reload my save and it's fine. Yeah, we're looking actually pretty good on beans. 900 means uh, we have 130, right? Wait. Yeah, the question is, do we want to buy six or seven cards? That's the thing. I don't actually know which one I prefer. We could buy seven, actually. Oh, yeah, and then have the Hess on Hagrid's hut. That's maybe actually a cool idea. So how many beans do I need for seven cards? Well, so let me ask different. 884 divided by seven how much is that <laughs> 126 okay that's pretty bad that's pretty bad so we still need some beans but that's fine we still have some level to play we have a whopping one card <laughs> yeah i think i know what i'll do i think i'll buy seven and then i get the the hess on the hagrid card that's probably wait this is dumbledore's office <clears throat> I mean, there's no other cards we can get. There's literally no bronze cards in the open, if you think about it. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. I think, I think I'm sure what I'm doing route-wise. I'm fairly confident. Was that not the reason the run died yesterday? Yeah, because I didn't get the final card. But now I will remember, like, definitely. Yeah, I'll get the exterior card before Aragog, and then get Hagrid's card as the last one. So we don't have to bother with the bronze one in Forest at all. Chamber is too late. We need the health upgrade in the first room and chamber. So getting it in the chamber is too late, sadly. Yeah, no, no. Okay, I know what I'm doing. We just need some more beans, but that's okay. Yeah, essentially, we need the two health bars after forest. That's the, the latest point we need to have them. Do I go for this boost? I've been so shit at that lately, but it's fine. I can just, you know, I can just reload if I fail it. Okay, it's not that bad. Cast, by the way. Yeet. Get some beans. Yeah, let's not just jump into the chamber without thinking this time, exactly. I do buy the cards after Spongify, yep, exactly. Shit. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. This run's already bad. It's okay. We don't have to stress. <laughs> Time doesn't matter. We just have to beat it. There's a couple of like hard strats left. This is not one of them. This is just a normal freaking all wizard card boost, but you know. Actually, oh, I had the same issue last time on high graphics. Actually, maybe this is kind of weird on high graphics. I remember dying exactly here yesterday as well on high and then first trying it on low. 
So I don't know why, but I feel for that boost it actually makes a difference. Let's see. Yeah, it's like... Okay, I still failed it, but... That's because I, um... That's because I boosted, like, really late. Like, I boosted super late because I missed the button and I still almost got it. Yeah, this is, like, so much easier on low graphics. I don't know why, but it's, like, so much easier. It's weird. So, I need to... Fuck off. I need to switch graphics. That's a big pixie, isn't it? Is that just me? You found me. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe, like, you boost higher because... I honestly don't know, but it really feels, like, a lot easier. He looked big, right? He was, like, a, a very thick pixie. Why are they all so big? Though? Is that normal? I feel like we're getting the invasion of gigantic pixies right now. <laughs> Maybe that's just me. Maybe that is normal. Uh-oh. Can you not... I kind of like my potions. I mean, I also want the beans, by the way, in case you're wondering what I'm doing here. It's probably not worth it, though, let's be real. We almost have 900, so that's cool. Yeah, I mean, I've, maybe the ones in Vicorn are just smaller or something, because I I, re I remember their size quite well. That's another one, unfortunately. 21. Sadly. Oh, no, don't cast that one. Yeah, they, they've all grown old, exactly. The, we spent so much time in Bicorn, they just, they're just all, like, super old now. That, that's that gotta be it. Dude, I cannot get that war walk anymore. I don't know why. I'm really bad. Yeah, I can... If I'm really low, I can make some more things with it, yeah. Feel free to remind me. I'll check my potion situation when we get there. And we'll see what, what we have to do. Or what we can do. Oh, I should have gotten those beans. Feck. Those would have been kind of free. That's one. Twenty-three. I believe that should be the same amount of cards like as after go uh, after last. Or oh, okay. <laughs> Focus. Talking is hard, but not that hard. Uh, I believe. 23 should be the same amount of cast as we had last run, right? At this point. Does anyone remember yesterday? Because I don't. I don't remember an hour ago, so don't expect me to remember yesterday. 8 potions left. Yeah, that's not bad. Should be enough for forest at least, at this rate. Man, I, I, I mean, I'm still gonna finish this, but... I don't like this time, so we might have to do a rerun of this at some point. I guess when someone requests it again. What did I already say? I already forgot the question. God damn it. Did we have 23 cast after Goya last time as well? <laughs> Yesterday or not? Yeah, we did infinite potions, exactly. I mean, I would be down for a rerun, but maybe not like super soon, to be honest. Also, Goy theme still being absolutely awesome. I love, I love this theme. 23 is a good number. It is the best number, exactly. We'll see what we land on in the end. It should be roughly correct. Yeah, it's kind of cool if we would be able to, like, trade with people as, as Goyle. That would be kind of cool. But sadly, they didn't want to code that. It, yeah, absolutely. It absolutely has a Halloween vibe. I 100% agree. Alright. Slytherin. My favorite challenge. It's actually quite chill. I like it. It's a good challenge. Uh that's a good question. I, I assume they don't I assume they just play like Harry's voice line, to be fair. I did have 23. Okay, perfect. Thank you. That's two more. Thank you for checking. You've been in work at work meetings since this morning. Dang, that sucks. Getting buried with work. That's rough. But welcome back, Bernino. We've at least we've made it out of the worst part of this run, so now we just kinda wanna finish this. So just some chill level. A gnome trap for Goyle. Yeah, a lot of people don't know, but Goyle is actually like scared of gnomes. It's like elephants are afraid of mice, you know? Which is just a myth, by the way. That's not true, but still. It's the same, the same logic here. Worst part of the run is when it ends. Oh, not for me. Absolutely not for me. <laughs> it's gonna be great when it ends. I did add that, right? I'm not sure if I hit the button to add a spellcast. Ephraim auto boost time? 
No. Oh, for the bridge skip? Yeah, you can do that, but it's like silly and it doesn't save much. You can also just do bridge skip. <laughs> I did. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Then we're good to go. Sadly, a lot of uh, spell cards in Slytherin, you just can't do anything because they uh, block the path. Yeah, finally. Took us a while, Mace, but we're getting there. Like, this is not going to be sub 3, I don't think. Actually, maybe. Nah, I don't think it's going to. Ah, uh, maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Depends on how well I get, like, the hard strats that are left, I guess. If this sub 3s or not. Uh, it should be possible, to be fair. Watch the snake trying to eat itself. Yeah, snakes are freaking fools. Come to Bokia. Nope, I'm not. Whatever you said. 34 remaining. Yeah, I should be fine. A lot of those at Aragog, by the way. I mean, I assume... I Actually, that's actually interesting. I assume it's like... It, it didn't start digesting itself yet or something. Otherwise, I feel like it would have realized. <laughs> okay, Spongify is easy. Wow. Uh, Aragog is seven. Seven is the lowest possible. And then eight on the webs. So that's literally 15 for the Aragog fight, which is super dumb. It's like half of what we needed until this point, just for Aragog. But there's sadly nothing you can do. Trollstaven som tycker upp framför att röra sig längs formen. När trollstaven är placerad precis över pilen. I'm curious if we're gonna get into the bean bonus room after this. We'll see. If not, it's also fine. If we do, then we're definitely good on beans. Like, beans are actually not that much of an issue in this route. It's actually quite nice. So we can definitely buy seven. That's gotta be better then. Yeah, I got into it yesterday, but like not a lot of time, but... Um, you have to keep in mind Slytherin had worst RNG initially. But this run, we've done another Quidditch match, so we have an extra 40 points. So I feel like we should get in. We'll see. A big even number, ah, I see. Yeah, 8 is a big even number, that's true. For the webs. Is there anything hard left though? I mean, I guess forest is remotely hard, but not really. I feel like we've, like, if I don't forget to collect the card, we've kind of almost done it. The rest is not that bad. <laughs> I shouldn't say that, should I? Oh, that's a good idea, Bamper. I mean, nobody has disproven that theory yet. Who knows? If you keep your game open for four years in the Aragog fight, oh, you probably would die, though, to be fair. Maybe you can find a spot where he can't hit you. Then who knows? Maybe eventually Aragog just dies on his own. Might be. I don't think anyone can disprove that. Mm, I didn't get Lockhart's beans, but I don't think I need them. I'm pretty sure we're fine on beans. Like, I, I rerouted the bean bonus rooms and Quidditch quite a bit. <laughs> if, you, if you wait a year too much, you die. Actually, actually too, if Harry hits his uh, seventh year, then he actually dies himself. That's sadly another one that you cannot skip. This room is annoying, by the way. This room is the reason why you have to teleport out of this in low cast as well. Kinda sucks. Good Spongify. Ah, ah, gotcha, wizard. Okay, thank you, thank you for. Okay, that that's that's an easy way to save. Then I'm gonna try that this run. Are we not getting in? Okay, wow, Slytherin having like so many more bean uh, points. Uh, ah, uh, we need three more, don't we? To um. Mm. Okay, you know what? I'll get Lockhart's beans. Because I, 128 is pretty shit RNG, that's not great. I think, I mean, it's a cool secret, so might as well. Like, I don't want to wait until I get that, really. So, uh, let me get those real quick. I should have boosted, I'm not... Okay. I can just suicide, actually. Yeah, I can just suicide. That spellcast doesn't count, I'm gonna kill myself. Uh, not what I meant to do, but sure. Oh, you do, Texan? Oh boy. Please don't make it a GBA one, though. Hey, we can go back to the thing. I... Yeah. I was just doing spell tech mid-air, so yeah, that's just what happened. Suicide should absolutely be an option. Like, it's it's so much better with this, like, that you can do a spell cast, and if you die, it gets undone. Because otherwise, nobody would ever go for some of the hard strats. Like, you would never go for some of the things, because you have to first try them, and if you don't, if not, it's not worth it. You just lose a spell cast, so it's just, eh. 
It's very nice that that is possible, just in case you do something silly like that. Hey, at least now I can boost, so that's cool. I mean, feel free to uh, attack some. I already have a Quidditch World Cup Hundo in the queue, by the way. I want to do that soon, though, so I guess a second one can't hurt. Any other open beans in this? I guess there's some in, like, the secret. I can go into that. Yeah. A low cast percent in single segment. Oh, without ever dying? Yeah, that would be sick. Without ge getting killed by the gnome. How many is that? 913? That should be 130, right? In that chest. They're not open air beans, though. <laughs> Oh, you want to learn Quidditch World Cup Hundo? Yeah, it's, it's it's not a fun run, that much I can tell you. 130, okay. So if I get those, I should get to 131. Oh, actually, is that only one? Oh, shit. <laughs> I overestimated this secret. Okay, 130 it is. Never seen those secret beans in your life. It's, it's one of the coolest secret that's, secrets that this game has to offer, honestly. It's really cool that it exists, in my opinion. And uh, it's it's like, I think, I'm pretty sure it's meant to be an easter egg. They don't even make the secret sound appear if you get it. So it's not even tracked anywhere. No, I just got those V8, so... Yep. Don't really, can't really think of any other ones, so I guess we just need to... Um... What was that? Wait, what was that? The, the beans and Rick de Sempra? Don't tell me you didn't know about them either. <laughs> yeah, there's a secret up there on the balcony. It's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool Easter egg. It's like 15 beans or something? 169. That's not what it is. Not what we need. This is the fun part. Like, our chances are not great. We need to get like a 1 in 10. Uh, no, not a 1 in 10. A 10 in 110. Whatever that is. <laughs> I guess it's a 1 in 11, essentially. So technically, if we talk to him 11 times, we should be fine. Statistically. Which does not seem to be the case. Actually, how many times did we talk to him? It's like the 6th? Let's do the 7th. The Let's say it's the 6th. That's the seventh. Still not it. Statistically, we're not unlucky yet, though. Nope. That's eight. So how do you beat a duel without a spell cast in that case? Nope. That's nine. Two, two more until we're actually unlucky. Expriamas, which is a spell cast, exactly. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Statistically, it doesn't have to be um, correct. I know, Kildeo, sadly. I wish. And what else would... If you say you... Wait, that's perfect. If you say you cast Expelliarmus, what else would it be than a spell cast? <laughs> it's in the name, but yeah. I wish, I wish it wouldn't count, but no, that's that's pretty clearly a spell cast, I would say. We got that though. It was actually, I think, statistically pretty normal, like pretty okay RNG, which is nice. And one more. Thank you. Thank you, Ravenclaw Trader. Not even 69 beans left. Sag. Alright. Anything else I have to do? No. We can just follow on. And this time, I'm not gonna forget the cards. Get the cards on the way to forest. Get the cards on... I almost cast it on that. I don't know why. I had a really strong urge to open that thing. <laughs> I don't know why. Don't question it. Uh, do I need... Po I mean, eight potions is fine for now. We'll see how many we have after forest. Uh, if I really need some for chamber, I'll make him, I guess. Game is a cool word though, so 
I can I can't blame you for saying it often. Hey, you could not cast at anything in this. I'm safe. There's no way to spell cast in this level. Let's go. Can I, oh, I could make it in forest. That, no, isn't it blocked by vines? Is it? I don't actually know. It might not be. I feel like it's blocked by vines though, if I recall correct. <laughs> yep, Tom Dolder, back at it again. Harry's playing tennis. Yeah, he's just swinging his one, uh, his his club. Sorry, that's what it is exactly. There you go. Okay, I'll get you, young Hagrid's in chat. Nay. I love how he's already drunk at the age of thirteen. That yell tells it all. <laughs> There's no way that came from a sober man. Your friend Hagrid. Uh, yeah, I, I do believe you can do the infinite potion glitch in Forest. I think that used to be like a, a bingo thing as well, if I recall correct. I, I do think the wall is close enough, but yeah, still, it's like you cannot open it, unfortunately. But we have to get the card. I, I really hope you can grab that ledge <laughs> on the night. Like some, some stuff changes on the night map, so... I really hope the grabability of one of the ledges does not change, otherwise we have an issue. Wow. Really? That didn't make it? Hmm. Okay. Well, whatever. Time doesn't matter. Yeah, the cutscene percent one, but like easier, thankfully. Like it's a lot easier than what you have to do in cutscene percent. The cutscene percent strat fucking sucks. It's like so awful. And it's still better than Zasta's ledge clip. Uh, yeah, it works. It, well, not quite. The issue with why we don't use it in this game is because it gets it goes away if you press escape. So you have to quit out of the menu with F4. Uh, but you get higher. Like, if you do the old school boosting like that, you get, gain more height than um, normally. But yeah, I cannot o close the menu with uh, escape. I have to do F4. Otherwise, the menu glitch breaks. So it makes it, like, really awkward to use. This is fine, right? Wait, how am I not making that? What? Am I boosting from the wrong spot? This is, like, not a hard boost. Is this different on night? Don't tell me this is like further away on night. I have to investigate that. Because this is not like a hard boost. You just go up and then you'll just land there. <laughs> like what? I honestly I honestly don't see how I'm not getting that. Except if it's maybe actually different. Yeah, that's that's what I'm going to try now, but I don't like I don't think it changes much, but maybe. But like I know that's the one I've done for, like on the on the night on the day map. No, this is the same though, right? Surely this is the same. Let's try it like here. We don't have to go that far, and then hold backwards at the top. God, this run is such a disaster, man. It's insane. Oh, I don't see the tower like this though, so I don't actually know how high we are. But no, not even close. 11 minutes later. No, it's not. You can't make that. This is different. Like, this is 100% different during the during the night. Surely. Like, I, I don't feel like I'm doing it that wrong that I'm just having no shot at making that. Okay, I guess we just have to remember to get that after Aragog. Don't brain let brainless walk into the chamber again, like last run. Like, either I'm doing something completely wrong, or they've somehow changed the map in, like, one way or another. Yeah, thanks for the reminder. That's also gonna ruin the Hess a bit. Mm. Yeah. That's fine. Weird. Actually weird. Can you do the cutscene percent boost? Yeah, but that one gets you like on top of something completely different. You want to go to the right. Like you want to be, you know, up here essentially in the end. Hmm, I don't know. It's fine. We'll just get it after chamber. Also, those are open air beans, but Hagrid is just like so far away. So it's not really... 
they're not really usable, at least not reasonably. Okay, I don't know, that was weird as fuck. I almost cast it at this. <laughs> that is not the strat. Nope. Don't you need health in Aragog? I would prefer it, but it's fine. Like, forest is doable with one health bar. Oh my god, that was awful. Like, forest is fine with one health bar, it's, it's okay. Yo, Ben. Yeah, you are, you are, you know, joining towards the end, but that's totally fine. Yeah, apparently you have to, Paul, uh, Polski. <laughs> uh, it would be great if people want me. Also, you can grab this. I'm not sure why. I found that out last, uh, yesterday. And I'm not sure, not sure why you can grab that. It's kind of weird. Uh, but yeah, how was your day? Hope you're doing well, Ben. Welcome in. We're still on the low cast train. We're looking for 65 casts here. Looks like we're getting it, at least, if I don't forget to get the card once again. So that's cool. But I hope you had a good day. Yeah, I would prefer to do all of this with, like, two health bars right now, but... Oh my god, yo, Solner coming in with a gigantic raid. Dude, thank you so much. How were the streams today? Welcome in, Panda. Yo, uh, Lemony as well. Uh, yo, Texanor. Thanks for the good luck as well. Yeah, we're doing like a, a challenge run, which is a legitimate category, which is called low cast. Um, oh yeah, I shouldn't get the card. That's a fair point. Whoops. So essentially, we're trying to beat this game with the lowest amount of spell casts possible, which right now we deem to ha to be uh, 64, but that's incredibly silly and will never happen. So 65 is what we what we go for. Uh, that was great. So, um, it's essentially, yeah, it's essentially just a challenge run. You see the amount of spells I've casted on my splits. If you die, they get reset, by the way. That's why I didn't add two more right now. Because we already did those casts. So every time we die, we reset. But this is one. This is one. This is one. Sadly, can't skip those. It's a cool run that has quite a few interesting uh, strats. But, how is everyone doing that, th that just joined in? I hope you enjoyed the stream. I hope you had, hope you had some good runs. Uh, thank you for the follow. Okay, this boost is quite hard. You can make that gap without using the the game's intended way of doing it. Uh, I did not do that correct though. That's okay. Oops. That was definitely not an extra defend though, by the way. That was definitely fine. What? Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Got the frog even. There we go. Holy shit, man. That took way too long. Okay, we've made it. Finally. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Confusing. Yep, thanks for letting me know. It's always good. We don't we don't want to ruin it now because this run at least has the correct amount of cast, which is really not easy to get. So, oh my god, really? Get out of here. Get out of town. Thank you. That's actually kind of an issue. You cannot really fight anything. So, if that happens, you're just kind of screwed. Geo after this. I mean, I'm actually I have I have energy, but it's getting quite late, so I don't know about the rest. I forgot the strat here. Oh my god, this is mildly terrifying. Can you guys not be there? Thank you. Oh yeah, I still need to spin. That's a fair point for like the uh, all leaderboards. Thanks for the reminder. Actually, I, that that's fine though. I've set, I have the board set up, so yeah. Yeah, they made them like really big in the Forbidden Forest, um, for whatever reason. Am I gonna die here? No, right? This is fine, I think. Am I gonna survive this? Oh. One. Cool. Forest, done. Well, we have Aragog, but Aragog is free. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right? Didn't miscount, did I? <laughs> I just have to fight him. Cast ones every time he comes up. I did by one. No, I didn't. Get out of here. Should end on 57. I remember that being the same account I had last run, which was correct. 
So I'm pretty sure we're fine. Yorking. Nice yokes. Yep, seven cards. Sadly, it doesn't work with less. Wow. I know this game. One potion is fine, right? Is it fine? Do we need to make potions? I don't know. If I really need them, I can always do them at the end of the chamber, I guess. How much health does he have? Do we know that? A hundred? Could be. And then it's like 15 every every cast on the on the weak spot, I guess. Make the damn potions. First I get the wizard card, okay? That we forgot last run, and that's why the... Oh. <laughs> First I suicide on accident, because I know this game. Uh, but then we get the card. I was so eager to get the card that um, that happened. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We got this. RNG manipulation indeed. I should have that command, to be honest. I'll look into that. I honestly don't know why it's in German. I, 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 I have nothing in German. My entire Twitch UI is in English, so I don't understand. It makes no sense. Okay, is this any different? Was I actually just bad? Like, if I die now, I guess I was just bad. Or is it, like, actually different? Now, I guess, moment of truth. Ah, thanks, Mark. Can't hurt, I guess. No, this is like, look at that. Okay, I, I held the wrong button. That It is on me. I slipped off my keyboard, so, but that's like so free. That it, It's different, that's my point. Like that was just me being bad. It's like literally different. That's so bullshit. Why did they change the night map? That's so dumb. Like I just, oh man, I don't know. I, I, can't, I can't be happy about this. This run's just really awful. But I also don't really want to do this anymore. <laughs> because the door clips are just the worst. Oh yeah, I think high graphics is actually better for this. I think I think I remember something like that. That might have been the reason during night as well then. I don't know, man. It's whatever. You just boost like way slower though. But I think it's like easier. Pog. That's nice, Mark. So we did get everything, I guess. That's good. Yeah, look at how easy this is now. Absolutely free. Okay, that's good to know. We, I guess we've learned that for the future. Uh, at least, that's something. Oh, have you checked, Chirp? Yeah, could be. Oh, that's if this is the tenth card. That's actually a good question. Do you die if you fall into it? I don't think you will. Yeah, usually we drop, we grab the latch. That's the idea. But I guess if this is the tenth card in this run because it worked out like really w weirdly, I don't think. Yeah, I think you survive. That's a good point. Yeah, I don't even have to do this like the hard way. Yeah, they they put you in a cutscene so you wouldn't die. Yeah, that's actually five fat, man. That's that's really five fat. Didn't think about that. Because this is not supposed to be the tenth card at all, but yeah. That is a five fat strat. I mean it's not gonna be usable for like the, the card route I have in mind though for the future, to be honest. Because it gets this card like way earlier than now. Do I have potions? Oh my god, thank god I have a potion. I could have been really bad without. Yeah, this should we should just survive this, right? Yeah, nice. That's actually very smart. That's really cool. That I don't have to grab the stupid latch in that case. Pock, pock strats. Cool. Um. Let me open this chat. No, okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna cast it anything now. <laughs> I'm not gonna ruin it now. 
Just chamber left, so we're good. We've, we're doing this. It's really incredibly slow, and I really want to redo this, but at least for the time being, it's fine. I'm going to make, like, two potions, I think, just in case. Three potions, whatever. It doesn't matter. This one's bad anyway, so might as well make some. Ah, you thought. <laughs> oh, sub two is probably doable, let's be honest, if you get a bit lucky in, in Bicorn. Less beans you lose, Emo? Wait, what? What's that referring to? When do you lose your less beans? Nope, oh, again. <laughs> Sorry, I, I'll stop. I'll stop scaring people. Cool. Don't soft love. Max percent low cast. Sounds absolutely fun. Sounds like a blast. And that's what we need two health bars. You see, it, it deal, deals like a little bit more than a health bar of damage. So, yep. Yeah, sorry for all the debates. Hey, nice. Oh, no, not the split. Adding a cast, that's what I wanted to do. First try. Doesn't really help this run, but that's a hard thing to get first try. And if you don't get it first try, you have to reload, which is quite funny. What do we do here, actually? Oh, yeah, chamber jump. <laughs> I know this run. Nice. Yeah. Hard jump, by the way. Nah, I'm not gonna do the small ledge grab boost. That one's silly. That one's actually silly. Yeah, right, Polsky? Happy Hogwarts being the best theme. I mean, the chamber jump is also silly, but... It's like not on the same level as silly. There we go. Um, okay. Yeah, I mean, in New Game Plus it makes sense, because it's really like... You know, you need to... Um, you need to... Uh, what do I want to say? You need to save any, any millisecond you can, that's what I want to say. In this run, it's like, whatever. <laughs> I'd rather do that, honestly. That strat. Seems a bit more chill. Okay, we have three more casts. That is indeed... Wait, where's the third one? I can only think of two, but it's gonna be... It's probably gonna be correct. Yeah, it's probably worth considering any adding milliseconds to... Oh, fuck. To um, New Game Plus. That's a fair point. Yeah, has all good chirp. We, we got it. We found it. What? Oh, come on. I don't think a category that uses debug mode should be main, to be honest. Like, New Game Plus is literally the definition of a misc category. And I don't think only for milliseconds that should be changed, personally. Come on. I hate auto boosts. Oh my god, Caldeo. Thank you so much for gifting two gift subs yet again. Thank you so, so much. Uh, I guess for the for winning this battle, hopefully, here. And finishing this run. Why am I not getting high enough? Appreciate that a lot. Thank you so much. Um, enjoy your subs, everyone, of course. Dude, I'm so bad at auto-boosting right now. There you go. I think I'm just going too crazy, actually. Oh, yeah, and high graphics. That's a fair point. So this one actually wants to change graphics, like, twice, I guess. To make it, like, easier. Where's the last spell cast? I actually can't think of it. I thought about those ropes, of course. There's none here. There's none at the block. Oh, the, yeah, the swing. Okay. That means we tracked it correct, though. That's fine, then. Nice. That's good. Alright, cool. Yeah, I mean, at least we got 65. Well, we haven't gotten it yet, but looks like we're gonna get 65. <laughs> I mean, I really do appreciate that, Kildeo. Thank you. I hope it was at least, like, fun to watch. It was fun to do, I have to say. Even though the doors definitely uh, almost destroyed me.
Also, I guess this is kind of like the one run where actually skipping the rock is somewhat useful, so that's kind of cool. Yeah, it's gonna be a 65 frag, which is nice. Um, if I don't like do anything stupid at least at this point. Yeah, you good as well. How are both of you doing? Hope hope you had a good day. It's only one more spell cast. Uh, oops. Well, as luck has it, Jagodo, we do have a command for that. <laughs> yep, thank you. Uh, why am I not going for the boost? Nobody knows. This run sucks anyway, so it doesn't matter. I don't, the only thing that doesn't suck is that it's a 65. That's the one thing I'm, I'm happy about. Everything else was absolutely awful. Yep, final spell cast. From now on, it's just a snake fight. Zero cast. Imagine it would be possible to actually zero cast this. Like, how stupid would that be? Oh, I actually don't have potions. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm not sure why it displays it in German. I have to look into that. But for some reason, when I use the built-in Twitch feature, it, it puts it in German. And I don't get it. Yeah, I mean... Time does matter. Go and get a 65 spell cast, and uh, you can see how time matters. Not my fault nobody else has that. At least nobody else submitted that. <laughs> At least. I actually wonder what TK's time is. I would actually love to know. It's probably faster than this. It it's actually really sucks, because I want to know, like, you know, record, essentially. So... All I can assume is that record is a 68 right now, because TK never submitted. It's actually kind of annoying, I have to admit. How did that hit? Yeah, well, 64 is possible, but it's like silly. Okay, I want to actually, I can maybe show the idea afterwards. In 230 whilst riding a unicycle. Yep, sounds about right. All right, 65 completed. Cool. Pog. Done. Uh, let me Let me try like two things. To the bonsai. Oh yeah, I can actually uh, show that soon. All right, have a good one, Sherp. See you around. Yeah, you get the idea. It's really dumb, and you don't want to do that. I mean, yeah, if there's multiple people that would go for this, I guess eventually it's gonna work out. That's true. But like, mm, I don't know. Just don't feel like it's gonna happen. Even then, I'm always way too late. Holy shit. I don't know the timing, so I have no idea. Yeah, I like that. That's actually it. But then you have to do it like, obviously this way you would actually um, lose a spell cast. Whoops. So you have to do it with the gnome walking towards the door before you can cast. And then you get this and you can go through. So that's the theory on the 64, but it's just, it's just, it's just stupid. <laughs> I think that's safe to say.